On the topic of user data privacy, have you ever read the privacy policy of websites or software that we use often, things like Facebook or Google or Bing? They're so incredibly complicated, and it feels like these policies are written by the lawyers for the lawyers and really not intended for us normal people to read. Now, as a computer programmer, imagine that you have the task of enforcing this policy on millions of lines of source code. Worse, there are 10,000 other developers who are in your team that are also writing programs. Now, we know how hard it is to write a program that doesn't have any bugs. And this, these sort of bugs are very hard to catch that might put the user's privacy at risk. So today, compilers help us find some bugs. But these are the bugs that result in crashes, or null pointers, or buffer overflows. They're very, they do not help us catch the bugs that make sure that the user's data is safe. And so this was a problem that we started looking on. And what we found was that there's really no common language between the lawyers that work on the policy and the developers that write source code. And so one of the first things that we did was we created a language for the lawyers to specify the policy in. This is a language that the computer can understand. And then we went ahead and created a new compiler that can check all the source code that people have already written and identify potential bugs that might be lurking in it. In the process, we actually improve users' privacy and check millions of lines of source code in very little time and ensure that going forward, these programs uphold the user's privacy and follow whatever compliance and policy that the lawyers and regulators have set out.